Oh, I'm starting this. Apparently, I am starting this video. Yeah. Yeah. Why do you talk like that? Stop! <laughs> stop having your Starbucks and tell me. I really must speak with you. I'm very close to your position, and and I know you want to hear what I have to say. No, we don't. Can you what explain the? all this? <laughs> it's like it was like SpongeBob, you know, when make you out weird. <laughs> 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 and why did that guy look like George Bush for some reason? Flopping Flounder, Mermaid Man, make out reef! <laughs> that was- I did not see that one coming. I- I- You know, I'm kind of blown away, sir. We should probably talk about the game. <laughs> yes, we should. Those past couple we did, we didn't explain anything. We didn't know what the heck we were doing. <laughs> I don't know. What happens when Andrew is here stays when Andrew is here. We're noobs. Fuck to what pond? Pound that noob with Uber Leap hacks and the prawn. <laughs> Ninja oh. stars of destiny. That sounds like them. Okay. Oh, let's get that guy out. No, he came out of a vent, but it looked like he did. <laughs> the moaning moaners have a lot more than we thought. <laughs> they got a lot of power into them, don't they? To let you guys all know. We are proud to announce that we finished recording. Yes, we did. We finished recording. We just had two chapters left and we finished it all. And we have a bonus video for you all, too. Yes, we do. That I was trying to explain everything and you just kept doing some weird stuff. Burnt and it hurt. <laughs> hey, it looked like you were in pain. I'll face for a bit there, man. I'm gonna reload good. this. Dude, my computer is terrible. Beatles! Was that about the Beatles? They're my favorite band. <laughs> Say that again. <laughs> is it this video or next that we got the new armor? It's um a little bit ways. Oh, look at this crapper. It's either the next one or the Ooh. after that. Oh yeah, look at that. God bless or something. This was the creepy part. This part is the one that still freaks me out about the cartoon. It was when like everyone's the lady like walks out with the towel and everything. He looks down and the fat guy. The first time you see the fat guy in the cartoon really. Is oh right yeah. There. And she tries running and as soon as she makes it through the door, <laughs> right through Goes her. Right, and she's yeah. all trying to like keep herself trying to keep going, here. but then he just. Pulls it out and she's just dead. See, stuff like that is what really creeps me out. Is when you don't see what's happening to the person, but you, like you see them like trying to escape and then instantly get pulled right back in and just hear what's happening. No, you know what freaks me out? For any of you guys who saw District Nine, the nail part, little things like that are what freak me out. Two things freak me out: a scene like that where something very simple, like a nail coming off, you know, like biting the nail off, or secondly, a rape scene. Now think about that. Rape scene is really... That's the one that freaks me out the most, because it's so demeaning and so horrifying. When you think about what's going on in your head. 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 Head! People! No! That was a sudden, wasn't it, huh? The client himself to sleep tonight on his huge pillow. I'm going to be cleaning your computer a little bit. Thank you so much. Someone has to do that for me. Sorry, must be all that porn I've been watching. Sorry, I don't watch porn. I'm more of an I'm more of a carrot more of a picture kind of guy. We all have weird fetish <laughs> We all have weird fetishes. I don't <laughs> You don't now. One day you will. No. One day you will. Well, one day if I ever get married, my fetish will be my wife. <laughs> oh, that wife of yours. I mean... I'd be like, gee willikers. <laughs> gee willikers, let's do it. Let's do it like they do it on Discovery Channel. Be like, oh, oh shit! <laughs> I forgot this part. I remember, like, this freaked me out. God, that was happened. <laughs> Whoop, you didn't see that coming. Of course, those are the ones where you just kind of have to guess where you're shooting. Look at it, like, transparent. <laughs> Maybe it was just a ghost. 
Uh, uh, girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez, he just looks like a random comic book hero. Who's his girlfriend? Lois Lane? Actually, he's kind of afraid of girls right now. Who's his girlfriend? Lois Lane? Actually, he's kind of afraid of girls right now. Why would she buy 10, oh, like 20,000 issues of- What? One million. Well, yeah, one million issues of this comic about a comic book character based on- Um, created by Lens Crafters. Lens Crafters. Lens Crafters. I, get my, I got my sunglasses from them, so I can't really complain. I didn't get anything from Lens Crafters, so I can! Dude, I got the red shot. I got the red shade on my sunglasses, dude. Just like those pictures you did. Yeah, just like that. Well. No, I think <laughs> we should. You know, Jeez, man. I, I think we should start talking about Dead Space, bro. Like how? Whoa! Like look <laughs> at the bear hugger. I step on your face. Hey, shut up in your face. Hey, listen. Shut up for, for a, a second. second. <laughs> Compressing old files. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Hopefully this will make your computer run a little you faster. You see, this is why I have friends like you, Luke, because I don't know anything about computers. As explained earlier, I oh, am a yes. geek raised by a nerd. I have powers. You see, and I was telling him that those are the most powerful kind of geeks. Now, you see, you think in most situations that if... Now, you see, I'm a geek raised by two geeks. So I'm a pure geek, you could say. Kind of like a, like a pure blood, what they'd say in Harry Potter. That's what they call them, right? Yes. Pure blood. Is I'm not pure bloods were the horrible ones. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess, <laughs> I guess I'm a terrible person. I don't know. I know, right? <laughs> what if that counts the same with geeks and all that? But anyway, I'll have, have to explain to you the tale that I told Jordan about the geeks and the nerds. You see, I saw that thing you put on Facebook. I have to tell you about, like, exactly what I said to her, because it is an epic tale. And she even told me, you know, that has to be one of the most, like, epic tales you've ever told me, but it ended the worst. It was, like, the least and it was the most anticlimactic ending ever. What was it? I basically said, and then there was peace. <laughs> between geeks and nerds? Yes, there's a peace between us now, because we have one common th ground, and I will explain it later. I would say that there is, to a degree... To a degree, there definitely isn't look behind. I'll, I'll tell you after this bit. You better. Because it's, it's guys like me and Blue that wrote the book on what a geek and a nerd is. I even had to explain to my cousin Allison that we are geeks. But Ethan is a mix between geek and nerd. I will have to... Uh, we should right record later. that conversation. We will. Because my, my Faja, Faja is an accountant at City Hall. Yet I am a geek. I was. I have the genes of a nerd. That's how I can work computers a little bit. Yes, you can. I think this is gonna end. Oh, look at that. 